I gotta get some expert advice. Uh, dear Abby, I am worried about what I really mean to Jimmy Dean. So far this week, he has said I am a sugar plum. I am the apple of his eye, and we make a pair, a peach of a pear. My problem is this, dear Abby. I want to be a pal, not a fruit salad. <laughs> hey, Ralph. Ralph, look what I look what I picked up out of the apple. Uh, what? What is that? It's a cat, isn't it cute? I think I'm going to adopt her for my very own pet. Oh, about that. He's given up me, a clean living, courageous canine companion, for a feeble, fuzzy faced, feline thing. <laughs> hey, hey, Ralph, isn't that the cutest thing? Look at those whiskers. Give her a little kiss. Uh, I never kiss a dame who needs a shave. <laughs> Ralph, uh, hey. Uh. <laughs> Come on at me. Guess, guess what I'm going to call my pet. What? Fluffy. Fluffy. <laughs> I'm getting nauseous. <laughs> now that's no way to talk to my itty bitty kitty. Did the big doggy scare my oopsie poopsie whoopsie little kitty cat? Somebody help me change Jimmy's diaper? <laughs> no, no, come on. What's that? You know that. that <laughs> you know a cat can be a perfect companion. Well, so can I. Uh, a cat can be affectionate. So can I. A cat can be playful. So can I. A cat can have kittens. Oh, I pass. Uh, <laughs> you know, these things, honestly, have got a very special personality. You know, they insist on going their own way. They they won't take orders from anybody. Mm -hmm. Are you, you talking about this cat or Jack Parr? <laughs> <laughs> Ralph, wait, Ralph, Ralph. Now, wait a minute. Mm. Brief, be friendly. Will you go ahead and pet, pet it just a little? Uh, uh, I warn you, you, you moth-eating milk lapper. <laughs> you scratch me, you're going to need more than nine lives. Uh. Ah! <laughs> scratch me! <laughs> Boy. Go mm. on, pet her a little. All right. She's been using that greasy kid stuff. Yeah. Yeah. You wound up patting a four dollar watch. And I don't know why you're so mad, because cats are very useful. You know where you find a cat around the house, you will never find a mouse. So what? Wherever you find me, you'll never find an alligator. What does that prove? <laughs> You know, I get the funniest feeling that you just don't like Fluffy. Meet my boss, the mind reader. <laughs> Look, I'll tell you what. Mm. Uh, if that's the way you feel, Ralph, mm -hmm. um, I guess we'll just, by golly, go ahead, get rid of her, put her out where I found her. Good. Fluff off, Fluffy. That cold, <laughs> that cold, cold alley. Right. I'll open the door for you. <laughs> what, what do you care? It's a poor, lonely little kitten that's going to freeze and hadn't got any place to go or keep warm and all alone him. without a friend in the world and nobody to feed her, take care of her. He does it to me every time. Out there home, <laughs> poor little creature, probably an orphan. An orphan. I'll just go ahead and throw it out in the back. Uh, oh, just, 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 just hold on there. It'll be over my dead body, Jimbo. You give me that poor little homeless creature there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dogs of America, don't you look. I'm about to kiss a cat. <laughs> Did the big bad cowboy scare my oopsie poopsie? <laughs> what, what do you say, Fluffy? Speak to me. Ah! <laughs> What's that? Here, 
I turned nice food and it claws me. Oh. No, What's no. the matter, Fluffy? The dog speak, you speak, got your speak. tongs? Huh? Some days. I'm gonna give him such a bite. <laughs> you. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it down. All right. I wish you would. All right. Fine. Okay. Because I'll tell you this. A cat will never come between you and me. What say? Let's be buddies. Be buddies. What say? What say? Now let's be pal. What say? Let's be buddies and build up each other's morale. I have been in that world I made. I never shouted, boom, but many the time I blew. What sing? How's I bought it? You know very well, old pal. I'll always 